And he says, I don't understand how a book can be so interconnected across authors, across thousands of years, unless it is. I've been on a multi-year journey through Genesis, and uh, one of these years I'll get through it. And I just keep coming back to these storylines and, and understanding it and, and finding new aspects of it. And you begin to see weird particular details, and you're going, why is that in here? Because Genesis is the foundation of a lot of what's happening in Torah. So it's laying out the groundwork for all these other stories. So often when I'm studying somewhere else in the text, I end up back in Genesis, and that's kind of why it's been a multi, multi-year uh, journey here. But I came across... This picture, some of you have probably seen this online. Jordan Peterson made this kind of famous in the last couple of years on a video. Um, he was talking about the Bible, and he, he came across this image of where somebody put together all of the references that connected in the text. So if you look on it from left to right on the bottom, you will see different, it's hard to see, but there's different grays and whites. It's a different Bible, uh, books of the Bible underneath here, and then all the references in that book or chapter. When I looked up this, I, I found this image. I was like, I need to know more about this. How, what data set did they use? What framework are they coming from? And all they did was use the references in the center of your Bible and made this image, which is remarkable, but it doesn't include location connections, family connections, chiastic structures, names, historical references, cultural uh, comparisons, geographical locations. It is just scratching the surface. There was a rabbi that was teaching a class in Harvard, and he had to teach on the literature of the Bible. <clears throat> and he avoided talking about the authorship of the Bible the entire class. He's like, I just didn't want to go there. He's like, I know my background, I know what I believe, but I didn't want to, I didn't want to approach that or teach that. And he said at the end of the, the, the semester, it was a, a, a lawyer um, that was studying to be a lawyer, raised his hand and says, why don't you explain a little bit about the authorship? And he says, the rabbi stopped and says, well, what do you think? And he says, I don't understand how a book can be so interconnected across authors, across thousands of years, unless it is different. <laughs>